Hey everyone, it's me, um, Tinta, and I'm back with a really quick like update. I realized in my like welcome intro to my channel video that I did not do the belly shot. Cannot believe that. So um, I'll go ahead and do it now. Today I am 21 weeks, five days, so I will turn 22 weeks officially on this upcoming Tuesday. So I want to go ahead and make sure I got this belly shot in, uh, so you guys kind of see where I'm at and different things and then um that's pretty much it. i can't really think of anything else so far that i left out of the first video um i'm off to run errands now so i don't really have a whole, whole lot of time because it is sunday and places start closing a little bit early so i want to just get this update to you guys really quick and then i will be doing a video of course uh sometime next week on my 22 weeks which I think I'll just do these videos like every Sunday that way I'm far enough along to where you guys can see uh, my progress for that week and then you know it's just easy that day and then Sunday's just a pretty light day for me anyway and I can guarantee that I have a video up by Sunday night Monday or at least Tuesday so um yeah that's pretty much it um i am going to do a video outside of my update i'm going to do a video on what i'm currently using as far as skincare and things like that so stay tuned really really excited about that i know a huge concern for us um soon to be mothers or you know pregos is that you know decreasing our, our odds and chances of stretch marks and things like that so so far i will say that i have not had a any occurrences with uh, stretch marks, stretch marks, excuse me. Uh, my mother didn't really have them, so I've heard, you know, different things between it's genetic, it's all about keeping your skin moisturized. My skin has always uh, been pretty moisturized. I've worked in the beauty and in skin care and body care industry for a long time, so I've always had lotions and body creams and different things like that that I've been putting on my skin for years. And then naturally, I just have pretty oily skin. Um, I do have stretch marks on my like thighs and like butt just from like when I was younger growth spurts and then building muscle because I was quite athletic so um, but I haven't really noticed any new ones since I've been pregnant on my stomach breast or thighs or butt or at, or at all so um, anyhow I just want to give y'all a quick kind of uh, you know what's coming up as far as videos and I do have a few more um that i'm gonna be doing so stay tuned but anyway let me get this belly shot before i start running my mouth too much so this is me from the front with the shirt on and i don't know if you can see that low but i do have like the little uh, headband trick going on here when i'm around the house i'm usually just um friggin have my pants like unzipped and just letting the belly hang out but if I'm going out somewhere I do try to make sure that they're at least zipped and these are still my pre-pregnancy jeans that I'm fitting into so uh, thank goodness for that I really don't want to, have to buy any maternity pants or jeans or any too many maternity clothes but you know if I have to I have to it's just a part of life so this is my belly from the side and I did have some crab legs earlier today uh, for kind of breakfast slash lunch so I haven't eaten a whole, whole lot, but I've eaten a good bit. You know, they're pretty high in protein. As you can see, I have a natural curve to my back anyway. I feel like the bulk of my weight's kind of gone to my butt <laughs> uh, before. So it's like my butt and my belly are competing. But this is my belly from the side with the shirt on. And this is my belly with the shirt up. As you can see, my belly button has made its way pretty much completely out, um, which is pretty surprising to me. I had a pretty deep any ahead of time, so I'm really surprised. But, you know, my uterus is moving up. It's pretty much behind my belly button now, so that's just baby, you know, pushing out, which is fine. So this is it from the side with uh, the shirt up. So, yeah. And then, here I'll scoot back a little bit. And then, from this side. So, yeah. And these little marks just come from, every so often I'll break out. 
on my stomach. They're not really pregnancy related. I have like hair follicles or whatever that tend to get a little, um, I don't know, ingrown or, or something. So every blue moon I'll have a weird blemish to, to pop up. So those aren't really pregnancy related that I can uh, attest to. So yeah, guys, that is it. I'll be back with uh, definitely an update this week and then a few more videos that are on my agenda. In the meantime, you can follow me on Twitter um, at Perfect Ten and then on Instagram at Perfect Ten again. I am also on Pinterest. That's New Mama Diaries, and I'll put all that in the below bar. And then, um, what else, what else, what else? Oh, my blog. I have like five posts pending on my blog that I need to just type up. I've been kind of had a, I've kind of had a writer's block for the past few days. But, um, so stay tuned for that. And, um, cause I update there if I can't get videos up. And that's, uh, newmamadiaries.blogspot.com. And again, I'll put all that in the below bar. And please rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you have questions, please leave them in the comments below. And other than that, I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching.